Hi everyone, it's Alicia with the Doherty Dozen and welcome to Around the World Wednesday where we make food for our family of 13 from a different area of the world. Tonight we are making Greek cuisine. We're gonna make deconstructed gyros or gyros, however you wanna pronounce it. I'm gonna leave it all deconstructed so the kids can pick and choose what they want in theirs. Uh, we're doing steak, the steak version. I'm also going to make up like a nice cheese charcuterie board, also a fruit platter, and cucumber tomato salad. These cucumbers are from our garden. I'll show you the garden because we've got to go get hopefully more tomatoes for the tomato part of it. And I've got the french fries cooking in the oven, just Walmart frozen french fries. Okay, so let me show you. Here is us. Wait, somewhere around here. New York. <laughs> and here is Greece. Josh is firing up the Blackstone, and then he's going to get going on the steak while I do the other stuff. I bought these at Walmart. I love these ones because they're like pre-sliced, ready for the Blackstone. And then these were their last two packs. So I got two more. And then Dash and I are, were running errands today, which I'll post in a separate video. And I grabbed more steak because, I don't know, I just, I felt like this wasn't enough. I'm probably, this probably would have been plenty, but we were already at the store to get the pita pockets, which I still couldn't find. This is what I got. I got pita bread. I couldn't find what I was looking for. We went to Whole Foods. Walmart didn't have it. Whole Foods didn't have it. Wegmans didn't have it. So at this point, we're just gonna use pita bread. All right, I'm gonna put on an apron. Josh, do you wanna do the steaks? Yeah. Okay. All right, so these are the Walmart ones. They're already hot. Mm -hmm. And then I got these. And then I didn't think this was gonna be enough steak and now I'm realizing it's I think it is a lot. So and you can save that for You wanna freeze this? No, don't freeze it because I'll cook it for lunch or something the next couple of days. Well then do you just wanna make it? I don't know. Figure we'll see what this looks like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then Yeah. I don't know. Just don't shop when you're hungry. No. Lesson learned. I learned that lesson. <laughs> Alright, so, how long that recipe? Um, no, just roundabouts. Season. Well, I don't know what is that. It was minced garlic, lemon juice. I don't know. Just throw some stuff together. Let's see, so oregano. Do we have oregano? Maybe. I think I, think I, think I used it all. I don't think so. I think I used it all. I'm like remembering that I used, I like used the last of it last week and forgot to write it on the list. Oregano, salt, pepper, lemon juice. That's it. Whose recipe are you using? Uh, it's crema de la creme. Always gotta give credit. Sorry, it's crema de la creme. I don't like to steal content here. All right. Started the Blackstone. I did. Oh, what other seasonings? So, S and P. S and P works for you. You're gonna cook it in that fancy outfit. That's my golf outfit. Oh, my head's cut off. Don't you think you should put an apron in? Yeah, I do. <laughs> I'll get it. I'll get it. Don't touch everything. My pinkies. Oh, alright. This is all we have left of minced garlic. That works. Get that too. That's plenty. Salt, pepper, oregano, lemon juice, minced garlic. What else? Olive oil. Oh, you know what? I want to use um. Avocado. No. I want to use uh, sea salt. Oh, sorry. Or kosher salt. Do you want EVOO or all 
Oh boy. I like EVR. Or whichever dog's barking outside. Because she looks at you. <laughs> yeah. That's plenty. I, I don't know. I don't know why I was thinking uh, it wasn't enough. No, no, it makes sense. <laughs> it makes sense. So I went to Whole Foods for the first time today. Oh, you did? Uh huh. Was it, it must have been busy, right? It no. Always is busy. No, it's oh, not. It, no, it was not busy, but it's a little overwhelming. It's just new. It is. Yeah. Look what I got for you. Sharp. Ooh, New York Sharp. Age demon. I'll cut up the peppers and the onions. I'll cut the onions because I want to do them thin. No, I don't cut onions thin. No, you do. I just want to do them thin. Fine. Fine. I got red onions and regular onions. Oh. Am I able to cut the peppers? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I cut those. Now go ahead and cut the, cut the onions now. Now you have to cut the onions too. Should have had a little patience. <laughs> Is this thin enough? I mean, yeah. Do you think that's enough or do you want me to do these two? I would do those two. Okay. So should I get these started? The kids are hungry. Or do another sheet. Can you do another sheet? I need to season. You don't want to just put those should on I top? I gotta I gotta do a little bit more seasoning. Can I I shouldn't touch? literally just walked in the door from golfing and I threw him into cooking. I love cooking though. He so didn't well. know this was happening. No, I did. I was prepared. <laughs> I was actually really excited about the zucchini. I don't know how you say that sauce. Mm. 
we don't really know how to pronounce things, so we just stopped trying. Tabbouleh. Is that tabbouleh? No. <laughs> That's a sauce, though. <laughs> tabbouleh is... I thought tabbouleh was a pasta dish. I don't think so. All right, I need a new pan. Uh, I'll get it. I'll get it. You got it? So the other big one has the french fries on it, so oh. I have to get one of the little ones. That's fine. tennis ball right here yeah she wants me to play fetch like when i'm, I'm like go to anyone else anyone huh. go with your human outside Honey, come on they show us already outside playing go well you gotta take your ball with you where'd your ball go you know this is Oma's fault she got her the tennis balls I'm gonna have to cook these at different times because this is thick and this is yeah. kids we used to play 70 some rounds a summer. <laughs> now I'm lucky if I get five. You got responsibilities now. Responsibilities, that's for sure. It's <laughs> what I hear. really funny girl on Facebook it's new she does this thing with chickens she goes and collects the rent yeah she does she's like all right and she curses she's like all right she's like it's rent time and then she went in there one day she went in there one day and one of the chickens had had chicks hatched chicks up up in a, like a nine foot cove up inside the chicken coop no way she's like why would you do this <laughs> She's like, all I want is rent. 
And you got oh, a chick yeah. up there, and come to find out, there was four chicks. Oh and my five, god! And five other chicks ready to hatch. <gasps> and the mom was like yelling at her. <laughs> the mother chicken, I, she has all the names for them. She's like, yeah. all right, Betty. And then there's these two broody girls. <laughs> know about that. Should I cut up more peppers than this? No, because okay. I think that's probably all everybody's going to eat. Should I put the onions with the peppers or separate? No, I'll keep them separate. Because I feel like the onions will overpower the peppers. Because Peter Piper picked a peck of pick up peppers. That's true. Pickle peppers. Peter Piper picked. Peter Piper picked the peck of pickle peppers. Did you know peck's an actual unit of measurement? Yeah. Who knew? You know how I learned that from? Sesame Street. Yeah, I learned that from Sesame Street not, not too long ago. <laughs> What's, doesn't she just in here? Dogs. Alright, how many onions should I do? Thin slices. Thin. I got you. I got you. I'll make them so thin you won't even be able to see them. Wait, no, you want to be able to see through them. That's how thin they should be. You should be able right. to count your fingers. Right, they're going to be like translucent, I guess. Whoa. Translucent? I used a big word. Right I'm not there. sure. I'm not sure I was waiting for that. Because I think it's not good. Oh, don't cry. Making honey. my eyes water. Don't cry. It's okay. I need some of the red onion for the cucumber and tomato salad, too. Oh, yeah. I was excited about that. Are you going to tell me how many onions I should use? Three. Like these three or like three white? Do two white and two red. She doesn't come back. Also, if you are feeling trapped by your spouse, that is not a joking matter. And here is the number to call to get help. Those are cooking fast. All right, I gotta go cut the onions. I'm gonna set some in here for grilling. I'm gonna put some in here for the cucumber and tomato salad. And I'm gonna flip around my oven. French fries. I, I give up. I give up talking.
platter for dessert because we're gonna have like a lot of food and I didn't plan a dessert so that's what I'm gonna do oh and that is leftover from Patrick's birthday party uh, so I want to use that up too I can tell by the boots. Hi. Hi. How you doing? I'm tired. Yeah. You see me? Let's just say we, it took us almost five hours today um, to try and put it's what they call a smart reel. Mm -hmm. It's literally just a big um, drum putting wire together. It took us five hours to do because one of the drums that we got from Alfred was all banged up and we tried to get it out. Didn't work. That's annoying. So now I have to go in at like six o'clock to finish what I had to do. Because the trucks can't leave without the stuff that I do. So pretty much. Um, this way or this way? Trash This way or this way? Get along. But wait, this way? I feel like onions are one of those things like spinach where you think there's gonna be like so much and then they all cook down and you're left with like one ounce. such a bad headache today. Actually, I had a ocular migraine and then that went away, but like the lingering headache stayed. Then I went into Whole Foods and that did not make it better. There's like so many different competing smells. Not like bad smells, but just smells. And now I'm cutting onions. I should have let Josh cut them. which is a godsend for years we were taking it to a laundromat now we can do it in our house again pretty much do like five loads a day and just try and keep right on top of it Next week, next Wednesday, I'm totally wrong. Next Wednesday is Harley's 
birthday. So we're not turning around the world night next week. So the week after. humidifier telling us it's full. Okay, that's it for that. I'm gonna get started on the Papa's platter. peppers that were like they're not bad but I didn't want to eat them so I'm gonna give them to the chickens because I think Josh would have already done that and I'm gonna bring them these cores okay so yes Josh gave them the peppers there you go girls some more oh I just dropped a paper towel okay so we've got green right there is hey hey Brown is general sour, no, brown is sweet and sour. Red band is general sour. Blue is, uh, not here anymore. Purple is Elvis and pink is Henny Penny. Did I say them all? I think I did. We have six now. I love peppers. That's weird. Okay, Josh and I were debating if the onions are supposed to be cooked or not. So well, I'm cooking them now. We're cooking them now. Because I wanted them to cook. Exactly. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to check the garden for any more tomatoes. Ew, these are orange tomatoes. And I see a bigger red one over there. Jealous of my orange cracks. Okay, oh, I see one over there too. I see you hiding over here. That one needs about another day. Okay, that's it. I'm just gonna cover this meat up. reminds me. I saved the tomatoes from Taco Tuesday last night. I'm going to grab those. I'm 
gonna be a mishmash tomato cucumber salad. This one was actually from the farm stand that I forgot to show you guys. Like olive oil with parsley, salt, stuff like that. Mm -hmm. What's wrong? We're not turning around the world night next week. It's Harley's birthday next week. Oh! Yes. We're doing hot dogs. Around the world, around the world. Now we got two weeks to plan. For France? Yeah. That's exciting. Paris. We should do escargot. Ooh, that'd be fun. Do you know what that is? Yes, Joshua. You're gonna eat snails? Yeah, I'll try it. I was just gonna try it. I'll try it. If they're made by somebody. I'm well, yeah, I know I'm not cooking them. Let's <laughs> just recall the lobster scenario. No, oysters. Or no, uh, scallops. The lobster? No. Remember when we cooked the oh. whole lobster for around the world night? Yeah. We can never eat I'm traumatized. Traumatized. I can't look at lobsters anymore. I bet the kids would get a kick out of snails. Sorry, Deshaun's bouncing a ball off the house right there. There's all these random noises. Oh, this smells so good. Oh my gosh. Oh, I forgot the feta. Yeah. 
I love feta. Probably my favorite cheese. Okay. Pick up a quick little cracker board and we're good. Okay, this is Gouda, mild Gouda. This is cranberry goat cheese. We did that thing where you go in a store because you think you're grabbing one thing so you don't get a cart. And you end up with like a zillion and a half things and you should have gotten a cart, but you're too stubborn now. Yeah, that was us at Wagnons today. Okay, I got olive oil crusty. Your New York cheese didn't make the board. Oh, no. I'll have it another day. Should have gotten almond stuffed ones. 
What'd you get? Blue uh, cheese and what? No, I got feta and garlic, but now I'm wanting an almond stuff. Mm. What's the feta like? Are those feta? These ones are feta. Oh, can I try one? Yeah. I'm talking to myself. Mm. That is my favorite. Those are good. Oh yeah. How can you do that jalapeno one? Yeah, no. <laughs> Those are spicy. Yeah. if she stares at me, walks in her kennel, stares at me, walks in her kennel, I'll be like, oh right, I forgot to feed you. I feed them at six too. See? Don't go a minute past six. was not nearly as excited as I was. But yeah. I had gone this week to Walmart, Whole Foods, and Wegmans. Wegmans for the win. Figs, I've got honey over there. I'm gonna save all the fruit. And I've got some prunes. I'll save the fruit for dessert other than the dried fruit. It's gonna be good. I got each prunes every day, like two or three. Okay, I think we're good. You just set everything up. All right, here is the spread for dinner. Deconstructed gyros tapas platter and cucumber tomato salad bon appetit okay i threw together a fruit platter for dessert all right around the world night greece was a success very very good thank you for joining us for around the world wednesday you are strong you are beautiful you are loved you belong and i am so proud of you i'll see you next time